And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's Benfica, and they face Al Nasser. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And this is how the starting 11 looks for Benfica. Well, they're playing in a 4-4-2, with one of the strikers just dropping that little bit deeper. His role is to find space between the defensive lines, but he can only do that if his partner makes forward runs. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And they kick off here. Rafa. And in possession, Chiquinho. Rafa here. Moving it forward. Excellent vision. Not a great challenge, free kick here. Not a lot to be positive about where Anderson Talisca is concerned. Stuart, what do you think we might see from him in this game? Well, Derek, in the last game, he was absolutely outstanding. It wasn't just the two goals that he scored, but it was his general play, his link-up play, his ability to run beyond defenders, his ability on the ball to create. I think we're going to see more of the same today. And he's through here. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. They take it short. Another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Taken short. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. And the short option preferred. Grimaldo could go ahead a goal to give them a 1-0 lead an excellent value for that advantage you've got to say well let's look at this again the one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure but I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily I thought that was stoppable. Oh, 
Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Abdullah Al Khaybari. Good looking sequence. It needs an accurate cross. Well, not a great ball played in. He's showing a real will to win the ball. This could level it. Well, it's ended up being, quite frankly, easy for the keeper. Well, he should be hitting the back of the net. That's a poor effort. Joao Mario. Ramos. And he has options available. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Delightful pass. Ronaldo. Here's Anderson Talisca. And a very good challenge. The tackle completely mistimed. And you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, the card is out. And it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Abdul Rahman Hari. Here's Ronaldo. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Bar. On the ball, Florentino. Chiquinho. Grimaldo with it. Aursnes. Promising attack this. Marvellous anticipation. Anderson Talisca. Here's Ronaldo. Breaking at pace. Cut out by Otamendi. Bar. Well, pressing really high. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Rafa. Joao Mario. The pressure was high and they could be in here. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. A glorious chance. And it's gone in! The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. 
Well, how often do we say this? Cristiano Ronaldo has struggled to get into the game, not really making much of an impact, Stuart. Well, I've been disappointed with his game so far. As those touches show us, he just hasn't been getting into the right sort of areas. That's got to improve if they're to get back into this one. And the match is underway. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Chiquinho. It's with Rafa. Joao Mario, a chance to whip it in. Rafa, he'd really have to switch on the turbo to get to that pass. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Rafa, superb block. Great opportunity, and a goal to increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? Well, here's the replay, and it's a really good bit of play. Watch how he turns his marker and then has the composure to finish. That's a top-class goal. Three goals without reply. Oh Abdul Rahman Hari. Going well. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, as expected, Benfica have had more of the ball so far. Yes, they've played well when going forward. It's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. So a personnel change then. Florentino and strong play here. But he knew he had to get to the ball and he did. Cristiano Ronaldo. Electing to cross into the centre. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. And the snuffing out of the cross there. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Well, they've decided to make a change. Ba. Musa. Joao Mario. 
Really good interception. Alvaro. Al Khaibari. Kono. That's a lovely ball. Great block. Flag up, tight offside. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Musa deserves credit for winning the ball back. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. They can bring it out now. Given away by Benfica. Cristiano Ronaldo. Return to Ronaldo. Making progress. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Still trying to make something happen. And that is going to be that. Well, a tale of woe in terms of the scoreline as far as the visitors are concerned here. Well, Derek, that just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positive, Stuart. Well, he scored a good goal, and if I was his coach, I certainly wouldn't be worried by him missing a couple of chances. The fact is, he was a constant threat today.